Welcome back to Learn With A Classic. We're in the workshop and we're gonna be doing some preventative maintenance, but we're gonna stay pretty clean. We won't be under the car, we won't be under the hood. In fact, we're gonna stay in the interior and have a look at one of the most overlooked pieces of maintenance, taking care of your car's leather interior. I'm gonna show with the use of some simple products, a good leather conditioner, and if needed, a good cleaner, how you can make your leather interior look like new and last for many, many years. Let's start by having a look at the interior of this 1991 Jaguar XJS. As you can see, the interior is in really nice shape. And in order to keep it this way, we're gonna treat it just like you treat your own skin we're gonna clean it carefully and then we're gonna moisturize it or in this case, use a nice conditioner. The conditioner not only helps to keep the leather soft, it also protects it from the sun. And this being a convertible, these seats are exposed to a lot of sun and therefore dry up more quickly than in other cars. If you live in a hot climate, it's even more important to do this treatment often to prevent your seats from drying and splitting. The first step is to clean the leather using a high quality cleaner and a soft cloth. Start by grabbing a clean part of the cloth and spray it with some cleaner. And then start working it into the leather. With the seat completely clean, it's time for the next step, and that's the conditioner. I like to use liquid leather by Glipton. Uh, not only does it leave the leather really, really nice and soft, it also leaves a pleasant smell, which is a good bonus. But you're welcome to use uh, any brand that you like. There are a lot of leather conditioners out there. Just make sure that you get one that's pH neutral and doesn't leave a greasy or sticky film. It's really important not to skip this step and condition your leather. Because now that you've cleaned it, you basically just opened up all these pores and it's going to age a lot faster. Basically, you've just made it worse. So don't forget to use that conditioner when you're done. It's also what's going to leave that beautiful new leather look. Once again, we're going to grab a nice clean towel and find one end of it. Grab your conditioner, shake up the bottle, and then put a little bit on one end of the towel. And we're gonna simply, are gonna work it into the leather with a circular motion like so. Make sure to get down in all the cracks and to get all the way around. And I'll just get some more conditioner and do the rest of the seat. If you find that you have an area that is exceptionally dry, you can actually pour the conditioner right onto the area and then massage it in in a more thick layer, like so. Once you've covered the whole seat evenly, uh, let it sit for about five minutes and then grab a clean part of the towel and start drying it off while at the same time rubbing any conditioner left into the material. Don't be afraid to massage it pretty hard like so. You don't want any of it left on the surface. Let's see what a couple of minutes does to your interior with a before and after.
I don't know how well you can tell on camera, but the color is already a lot darker and it looks a lot cleaner. It's already a lot softer. So now I'm just gonna do the other side as well. Don't forget to clean and condition any other parts of your interior that are leather as well. Now with all the leather treated, it looks a lot richer and fuller. The black is a lot darker and it's already a lot softer than before. I recommend that you condition it once more in about 48 hours. And if your leather is really dry, then again after about a week and then after about a month again. If you live in a hot climate, I recommend that you condition your leather every month. Otherwise, maybe do it every time you change your oil or do any other maintenance to your car. It does really make a difference and it helps you not have to replace your leather interior in the future. Now that looks really, really nice. In about an hour and with some simple products, you can completely transform the look of your leather interior and make it look, feel and smell like brand new. So why not try this on your car? It's simple and you'll be really happy with the results. For more videos like this, check out my other content below and subscribe to Live With A Classic. I put out new videos every Thursday and sometimes you get some bonus videos in between. You can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram. There are links down below to both of those channels. Until next time, I'm Adam and this was Live With A Classic. See you soon.